What's up, Wayne Baron here with doggyfakes.net, and uh, we're doing a unboxing here. Uh, I like using a big keypad whenever I'm working, and so whenever it comes to my cell phone, it's really annoying to have to type out, especially whenever I'm trying to design websites that work on mobile devices. It really gets annoying, especially if I got a long address that I've got to type in. So what I did is that I went over to Walmart. Uh, I went over to Walmart last night and picked up another one, and I had to take it back because it would not work with the I um, with uh, either the iPhone, which is what I'm recording this with right now, or it would not work with the Droid. So I took it back, got my money back, and I uh, picked up this one. Was able to test it before I brought it home to make sure that it works. So what we're going to do is that we're going to unbox this brand new one, and. Uh, Take a look at it. So let's go ahead and get this thing undone. But definitely got that thing on there just a little bit too tight. So. <laughs> As you can tell, it's the first time I've ever opened up this one. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it's uh, specifically designed basically for a keyboard. I mean, for, I'm sorry, for a, a pad or something. But it does work with your iPhones or with your cell phones. And so let's go ahead and this right here is the cord to charge it plug it into your laptop or computer or whatever uh, USB and so this right here is our keyboard and uh, that's basically about all that you get for the instructions I mean it's it's pretty common sense got the on off switch right here so we're going to put that to on and uh, as you can see, the power button just came on. So what we're going to do here is that we're going to come over and we're going to go into our tools, settings. Now this is on the droid. We're going to click on Bluetooth. Then we're going to search for device. And there you go. It automatically picked up on our keyboard. Click there. And now it's telling me to type in this number. So two one 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 two six and then click on enter and there you go it's added in in as a uh, as a bluetooth item <laughs> whatever so let's go ahead and test this out really quick let's um get out of there let's open up Go to Quick Office, and let's do. Uh, yeah, we're just going to get rid of all this crap here. So let's let's come down to the bottom. Then we should be able to space down, space down. Hello world, perfect. Works great. Love it. Absolutely love it. Okay, well, uh, yeah, this is the unboxing of it, and uh, so now I can actually work. Uh, designing my websites with an actual keyboard instead of having to click here and then all right so i mean it's it's not even going to bring open the, the the keyboard the type of there with this here so that's fine with me i mean i'll be taking this thing around with me everywhere so uh yeah can you see it now i'll be sitting at a restaurant or something with this right here out actually typing on there so that way if I get an idea uh, it's really hard to talk to uh, the cell phone whenever you get an idea and you're in a public place keyboards come in great okay uh, yeah it uh, the price of this the price of this item was right there 2127 was my total so uh, Okay, uh, yep, yeah, I love it. All right, y'all have a good one now. Wayne Baron here with darkfakes.net with my new Tazumi keyboard hooked into my cell phone. So now we're rocking. All right, y'all have a good one now. Bye-bye.